face to a fist fight. Time to suffer and die. I am a stabbing machine. Walk into my knife. Walk into my knife. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Come on. Come on. Come on. You two, let's go. Into the stab machine. Into the stab machine. Oh, you mother... Welcome to Classic Game Room. We've all heard about spies like James Bond, but how about the super spy on the Neo Geo? What really makes him super is that he can't turn around in hallways, so prepare for a lot of backpedaling and stabbing. <laughs> It's time to insert the Super Spy into the Neo Geo MVS arcade machine and output fun. After I play a round of Samurai Showdown, of course. The Super Spy! Feel my fist! It's the Super Spy, released for the Neo Geo in 1990. Is it as super as the title would lead you to believe? Best described as a first-person stabber or hallway walking simulator, the Super Spy is sadly super repetitive, but it's also super cheesy, and that makes it fun for at least 20 minutes. I'm gonna shoot the coffee machine. Oh, the coffee's all gone. That's... Die, terrorists! Maybe shoot the coffee machine. They're the same group that blew up the underground center. Whew, I was worried about something else there. Armed with your fists, a knife, and a pistol, occasionally you pick up a machine gun that runs out of ammo instantly. Your objective is simple, blow up the terrorists and insert quarters into the Neo Geo. You'll be continuing a lot in this game until you eventually just run out of patience or quarters, although it is a game that's good to poke fun at while you're playing. I don't know, you're the scientist, you tell me. Dumbass. The dialogue is terrible, the enemy diversity is non-existent, and it's repetitive beyond all comprehension as you wander down endless hallways and fight enemies in the exact same way each time until you eventually die and then just continue. This guy tries to headbutt me with his bald head. It's kind of creepy. Ow! Friggin' bald dude, you suck! So you move back and forth, punch, stab, and occasionally shoot. That's it. That's the entire game. A terrorist became good friends with my fist. The Super Spy is anything but super, although it is so odd and so cheesy that it could have been called the So Bad That It's Good Spy for at least 20 minutes. Even cheesy games can have moments of brilliance, though, like some of these end bosses who seem to have jumped straight out of an early 90s Steven Seagal movie. I see Paris, I see France, I see crazy bitches underpants. On top of that, we have exploding Neo Geo brand coffee machines. For 300 bucks a cup, it better be good. Bring it with! We could use a new knife! Who couldn't use a new knife? Great for stabbing and spreading butter. Knives are versatile. Too much blood! I'll treat it! Blood stopped! I'm stronger now! Alright. Medical science. What can't it do? A big thanks and a shout out to Dave from Brooklyn, New York, who sent this to the show and also thinks it's so bad that it's good. And it is. There's something immensely likable about the Super Spy, but you've got to play it in small doses. I can imagine back in the days this would have been pretty impressive because it has that first person shooter look to it, which wasn't as common in, well, 1990. And you gain experience when you defeat enemies, although it doesn't really do anything for you because every single battle is the same. Look at my statue over here, too. These are art lovers. Occasionally, there's some nice touches like the art in the background or this good music. Oh, no. 
Oh, that's a bad jam right there. We destroyed the factory and the plans. Six of ten bombs are gone. Hey, a car. Man, these terrorists are dumb as bricks. I don't want to die this way. Die with me. Ah. <laughs> oh. As I was saying, not so bright. Walk into my knife if you get stabbed, it's not my fault. A big thanks to Dave from Brooklyn once again. I would say The Super Spy is a game you should play at least once if you happen to come across it, but even though this one is kind of rare, don't spend too much to add it to your collection. After two hours, you'll beat the game and wonder where your life went. Stab, 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 stab. I really hope that's the end of the game. I've been playing this for like two hours. Who is it? Government dogs? I'll return you in a body bag. I hope you have the receipts. Oh.